this hand, I'm kind of going up and pushing down the mill. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She doesn't usually do that. Did I tell you this is the little baby? Oh really? Uh huh. So this is the young, very young. Uh, she's two years old. Probably nearing three now. Or she's probably three, because the other two that we have are two. She might even be almost four. How we could tell that they're ready to to mate? The ba they can mate as babies. I don't know about the females, but the males, like that's what uh, the little brown one in there, he's going to be our stud. And he's just two months. Oh, this big, won't you? Mm -hmm. So about how we could tell that they're ready to be bred? You mean like Zulu? How will you yeah. tell with her? Uh, I'm not sure, but I know in the fall they go into heat, and I'm sure there's something they do that you can tell. With the dog. There you go, here's yeah. the speaker. She's got a tube. Don't you? Don't you? <laughs> Who wants to drink that thing too? Hi, Coco. Alright. You just got one horn. Coco just got one horn. Because when you have the babies, you have to, uh, um, Horn them with an iron, a hot iron. You don't feed them corn. The goats? Yeah. Some people might. I don't think we only do the alfalfa pellets because it's high protein. It makes them produce more milk, and it's organic. So then we get organic. What do you think about all that? What do you think about all that? I don't know, it's fun. It's very new to me. I've never seen anything. Are you going to make me like this cell? Yeah. I told you the pallets over there. You can just cut those. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is rock salt. They like salt. They like. They love salt. So you have to get.